watching Boa TV. Kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. Click on the subscribe button down below and the bell beside it. This will notify you once we drop a new video. Thank you. Jesus. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this opportunity. We thank you for this celebration. Father in heaven, open thou our mouth, Amen. our ears, Amen. our minds, Amen. our heart, Amen. to be able to behold and understand wonderful message of your word. Amen. Thank you for answering our prayer. Thank you, Jesus. Since we have prayed in the mighty and precious name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen, amen, amen. In Jesus' name, fire confirm.
Two occasions are being celebrated. I want to commit your call. Could you hear me? She. Fifteenth year of the ministry. And the first year anniversary of opening, commissioning, and dedicating this subject. The theme for the double celebration is the theme for the devil's celebration is harvest of testimony. Only a totum every passage is found in Genesis chapter 40, verse 8. Genesis, would you go to SK Joe? And it reads, Do not, do not interpretation belong to God. Give me your dreams. That was said by Joseph. Joseph could also he when he was in the prison. But what he do anymore? With the chief of Pharaoh and the chief baker of King Pharaoh. And he said it to them. When they both had dreams. And they did not know the interpretation of their dreams. And Joseph, Joseph, giving honor to God. And he said, Don't do not interpretation belong to God. Even though he is the one who was going to give the interpretation. The second passage is found in Exodus chapter 5, verses 1 and 2. Yes, I read. Let my people let my people go so that they may hold a festival for me in the desert. Who is the Lord that I should obey him and let Israel go? I do not know the Lord and I will not let Israel go. Aaron, and Moses, and Moses went to deliver God's message to Pharaoh. And Pharaoh, you did fully. Pharaoh and he rejected the word of God. But not only did he reject. He said he did not know God and he didn't want to know God and of course he will not let Israel go. The third passage is Exodus Chapter 18, verse 8. Moses told his father in law about everything the Lord had done to Pharaoh, the Egyptian and the Egyptians, for Israel's sake, and about all the hardships they had. Led along the way, and how the Lord has saved them. Come to the title of my 
exhortation. Giving testimony. What then is testimony? Testimony is evidence given by a witness. Testimony must put God first. As we have seen in David uh, in Joseph. Joseph did and he made God the actual interpreter of dreams. So if you don't know she we must in our testimony. Make God look good. As Moses uh, as uh, Joseph had Paul and Barnabas answered them boldly. First, we must give testimony and speak about God. This is in Acts chapter 13, verse 46. Testimony is not showing off. Or pride. It, has, it is an act of Christian life and Christian living. It must be part of daily living experience of a Christian. Together, let us look at some reasons why we must give testimony or put another way, or put another way what are the purposes of giving testimony? One, it is an act of worshiping, thanking, and praising God. The Psalms are full of testimony of David. Worshiping, praising, and thanking God. I read when I called, you answered me. Psalm 138, verse 3. We Another one, I was pushed back and about to fall. But Lord help me. Psalm 118, verse 13. David's testimonies of God's greatness, immensity, and mightiness. And glory were great acts of worship God. And with such worship, God was pleased that he called David a man after God's own heart. If you go for a lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of people, and if you are for me, that you find in Acts chapter 13, verse 22. You know, we shall have posted the record as a little more. God Himself, a lot of people, David, a man after we love me, let me be a little Testimonies as acts of worship strengthen our relationship with God. The passage of Psalm 84, verse 2 says, My soul hangs even things for the courts of the Lord. 
in Ireland. The success of your ministry over the last 15 years is worthy of proclamation. Not only in this locality, over all the mountain top, and throughout the world. I know you. Thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button. Kindly comment and share. We drop new videos daily. Thank you.